What's up, party animals? It's your girl, May, and welcome to Bayonetta 2. Oh my god, I absolutely just loved the first game, and although it was hard, I still enjoyed it. But now we're gonna hop into the second game. Now, this is all to prepare us for when the third game finally comes out, and it will be coming out, I believe, on October 28th for the Nintendo Switch. So if you want to get the game and try it out for yourself, <laughs> Just mark the date, that's all I'm saying. All right? Now, let's get started. We're gonna do normal again, cause fuck that. And I'm not gonna do, well. I really want to be able to enjoy the game's story, but you know what? I'm somewhat familiar with the game's action, so let's just go with that. Ooh. Okay, so the last game had a whole red aesthetic. This is a pretty blue. So they done changed the whole aesthetic. I, okay. John Hey yo, what? The legend of Casey. A legend from the dawn of time. Nobody knows where the world came from. A struggle caused the trinity of realities to be split into three realms. Life, darkness, Chaos. Obviously, our world was the one born from chaos. The three worlds all needed rulers. Most of all, ours. And the one that ruled the chaos became known as Ace. Huh. So, we're just going to school. Apparently, there's just some sort of god. What the fuck? I didn't realize Bayonetta got What is that? Is that a mech? Oh, I love this so much. Aesir spent the first eternity quietly looking upon the Earth from his holy mountain. Where we only see reality and make it match our rules of the world, Aesir saw through them. And those visions became our world. These observations became Aesir's power. Aesir's eyes were truly the eyes that created the world. However, Aesir pitied the humans for their naivete and lack of free will. So the power he wielded was split into two equal halves and entrusted each to humanity's instincts. The right eye of light and the left eye of darkness. Huh, well that's where it came from. power of the eyes of Aesir, humans gained free will. They could now choose. With control of the eyes of the world, the eyes that determine destiny, humans could choose their own paths. They awoke to their own identities. Man is but a reed, the most feeble thing in nature. But now, we were thinking, and we took our first big step towards grand prosperity. The inheritors of the eyes of Aesir have been granted the power of creation. What the fuck is that? Another Lumen Sage. Bother telling me any of your kind survived. Well, it 
least you're the silent type. The last sage I met spent 20 minutes rambling on and on. What? No, it, no, I don't like, no. I didn't like you. So if you're trying to but say that- But the right eye of light was lost from the world forever. Along with its possessor. The last of the Lumen Sages. Wait, so then who the fuck are we fighting then? a child's board game and we were just a piece that was going around. Now it looks like the setting of a card game. Yeah. Oh! It's like a, um, uh, it's like a, like a makeshift stand for a tarot reading. If you're wondering how I know that. Mm. My grandmother used to read cards for people at one point. And she told me about it. Yeah, she says it's one of the reasons why I'm able to read dreams, apparently. Oh. Honestly, I hope at one point they do come up with a game. The name of the director <laughs> so disrespectful. Major Unleashed continues after these messages. All right. Hey, there's our girl. Know what I need? I just really feels without guns. You don't mind if we make a quick stop, do you? Do you know what day's coming up? Here I was shopping, minding my own business, then you show up and turn me into a damn porter. Seriously, Bayonetta, oh, you still haven't paid me back for the guy like hey, hey, oh, no. Now, now, was that any way to speak to an old friend? Besides, I did that job for you, for free. Dad, do I really have to tell everyone how you grabbed onto my leg, sobbing like a schoolboy? Your haircut is nice. This is why I can't have good things. You're some piece of work, you know that? If you weren't already lined up to go to Inferno, you'd be well on your way with all the shit you pull. Dressing up like a nun just so you could off some angels and keep the underworld happy. Hey, I'm talking to you. <clears throat> uh, shit. But if it's that, I get torn limb from limb for eternity in whatever circle of Inferno you witches go to if you break the contract. Forget about it. I'd off the fucking wing bastards all damn day. Oh, hey, what the hell? Hey. Oh, what the fuck are you wasting your time trying to send some schmucks off to the afterlife for? Oh. Done and done. Let's go home, Enzo. Hey, wait a second. I ain't done here. If I don't get what I came for, I'm gonna be the biggest mutt in the city. And what is it that you came to fetch, my dear? Eh, real <laughs> funny. I know better than to tell you a damn thing. I'll never hear the fucking end of it. Wait, 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 what the? Hello to 
do you do, Jean? You always know how to make an entrance, Jean. A rare sight to see you in the city. Just had something I had to look into. Cereza, you haven't felt anything strange recently. Now that you mention it, I still haven't quite figured out how a broke, bumbling wise guy managed to turn himself into a semi-respectable family man. Forget about it. And what's this Cereza shit? You're about as sweet as my Nona's grappa, you know that? Some witch with amnesia goes around calling herself a weapon, and it turns out she really got stuck with a kid's nickname. That shit's rich, I tell you what. <laughs> Our friends in Paradiso are far too quiet. I'm sure you've noticed. I've also noticed that your eyelashes are beautiful. And so are that makeup. They are the only ones. Pray tell. Our friends down south seem to be a bit upset as well. They have really intense smoky eyes. And now in Lighthouse, the annual holiday parade is being held today. City police have closed off roads to prepare for the massive influx of Wait, did she cover her eyelashes? to take in this year's festivities, set to be headlined by a flyover from the military's aerial acrobatics unit. Police have now to lose the That dress seems excessive. Oh shit! The Platinum Stars! Crap. We need to hurry up and get Ed and Edna's presents, or I'm gonna get it. Matching hat? We'll talk later. I'll see you back home. Don't forget to pick up the things for the party. Oh no, stop, no, please. She's about to cause an accident. Oh my god! gonna break it in some what the fuck? Yo! You know what? Screw the pretty ribbon! Just hurry up and put it in the box, will ya? The whole pilot just ditch. Oh no, the hat! You know I try to avoid doing this in my Sunday best. <laughs> oh shit!
No, I'm not using touch controls. I got a controller. Whoops! Wrong button. the last game I, 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 I I'm, I'm gonna admit I did have a little bit of a trouble trying to see so this is the blue aesthetic is actually way better especially since she's no longer wearing black against the uh, deep red which was pretty hard to see it's now a grayish against the blue which is a little easier on the eyes Shit. 
in this one. everything? I forgot the caviar. You think they're still open? You think they're still open? It's not Christmas without caviar. Let's finish this quickly then. Oh, oh, shit! <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, nah. Oh no! You fuck! Oh! 
have done better. Oh, 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 oh no, it's not bad. What the fuck? Oh! Gamora! Inferno suffering for eternity. Dims the brakes. I didn't ask you to tell me what I already know, Rodan. Especially if you're going to be flip about. 
about it. All right. You know better than that. You're not the kind to let that sort of summon go out of control, Bayonetta. Something's up. The balance of powers that keep things in check don't feel right, does it? You know, she's pretty hot for a dead chick. Ew, no, ew. I wasn't a big fan of her shit when she was in the realm of the living. But looking at her now, nah, still not a fan. Oh, you disgusting butter. She's not dead, Enzo. She's right, Enzo. You're only really dead after your soul's been completely absorbed into another realm of the Trinity. But that's just a matter of time. Because I don't see no way of saving a soul lost in hell. What about the gates? The real gates of hell? I can't stop you from trying to use them, but I don't think you got a chance down there. I'll see what I can do about putting her on ice for a while. You need this. The heart of an Umbra Witch. The magic that keep your kind alive in this world for eternities. Should keep her body in this realm stable. But you'll need to reunite this with her soul if you're gonna try and bring her back. I figure you got about a day before it's game over. A day? A day! Enzo, you've got a jet, right? What? No! No, 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 no. I do not know. Listen, I appreciate the situation, but you know what today is? My kids got cookies baked for me at home. They're waiting for me. And I still got to play Santa tonight. Let the real Santa take care of the presents. Now let's go. <coughs> hey, I said I believe. But Ed and Edna, you can't put one over on those two little fuckers, let me tell you. <laughs> hey! Let go! Let go of me! Why do I always get wrapped up in this shit? <laughs> Ain't this <a> motherfucker. So basically, the silver, instead of it being Luca in this game, is just some faceless Umber Witch. Is Luca not in this game? I'm gonna do another one for you guys. City of Genesis. Yeah, I'm, you know what? I'm not gonna leave it at the prologue for you guys, like I did in the first game. Besides, it's only been like, what, half an hour or so? <laughs> it's fine! Let's keep going! Whoop, no. Who is this hand that keeps flipping over the cards? I love her mood. well, actually, I kinda liked her old one better, but with the color scheme, it's way better. The Sacred Mountain of Fimbleventer. The joint's supposed to be the link between Inferno and Paradiso. They say there is an entrance to Inferno, the gates of hell, somewhere on this mountain. No one knows where, though. Hell, no one even knows if it's true or not. The only reason this overgrown rock is worshipped like some god in the first place is that no one's ever been able to get close to the damn thing. It's like it don't want you there. Every climber ends up stranded or worse. And don't even try to fly a plane near that place or bada boom! But at least your soul doesn't have a long walk to whichever afterlife you got lined up, right? I'll wait for you and know it to you at the foot of the mountain. Just hurry up with whatever it is you gotta do and get back there, all right? And the hotel's going on your account with a mini bar, too. Gotta right. keep myself busy while I'm waiting. Forget about it. Uh, I love those miniature drinks. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It doesn't look like Jean's being tormented. I oh, ew. Oh, ew. Oh, no! I can't. 
can't believe you, Enzo. I didn't know the in-flight service was exclusive to fat Italians. When the plane ain't free, you know. That reminds me, you owe Alex the kid for the charter. Whoa, oh, shit! Ooh, it's so pretty. It is so pretty! I love it! I love it, I love it, I love it! There it is! That's Fimblebit! Not such a bad place when you look at it. Oh, but you gotta have a death wish to get close to that damn place if you ask me. Wow. Gives me the heebie-jeebies. What the hell? Where did these clouds come from? This is where I get off. Say hi to the wife and kids. What? 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 Wait, what? You're joking, right? I can't fly this piece of shit! Oh, oh damn. has very decorative jewelry. I feel like it's important. John, I'm on my way. Just behave yourself for a bit longer. I want to check around. Oh my god! The witch heart. I knew it. I knew the bloody little rodent was important. Santa don't get paid enough for this shit. When Ed and Edna found that daddy wasn't coming back, made me stay all the way through dinner. Don't pretend you weren't delighted. I hear Enzo's wife makes a lovely casserole. It was damn good. I'll give you that. <laughs> anyway, tell me how my babies are doing. 
They're behaving quite well. They found plenty of playmates here. Figured they would. Noah Toon had some deep connections with Fimbleventer and the Gates of Hell back in its day. Wouldn't be surprised to find a few of those playmates that like it rougher than the typical bunch. Anyway, you need any supplies, just make sure you keep bringing me these halos. And remember, I ain't here to get up in your business. My business is making things that do business. So don't come crying to me when you... Again with this! You, you think you gotta do everything alone? I'm here to help. Just make sure you don't bust a cap at my ass. <laughs> I'm not here to help you, but I'm trying to help you. All right. Sir, which is it? Are you here to help me or are you here to not help me? Which is it? You know, under the lava. You know, that good is big grid. Uh. Well, shit. <laughs> These punches don't know which quick. What do I have to do to them? I'm never gonna reach Fimbleventer at this rate. Well, at least it won't be a boring trip. Oh, the fuck? You can see me. What is that act? Putting on quite a show, little magician. Oh, you like that, huh? Wait till you see the climax. Silly girl. You'll have to do better than that to earn a tip, my dear. To Who the hell are you? I'm just an innocent little girl lost in Wonderland, suffering at the hands of the Queen's trumped up troops. Keep one, huh? Enough riddles. How can you see me? Because we're both in Purgatorio. Gatorio. So, Here. are we heading to Thimbleventer on a shopping trip for Mummy, little one? Maybe. But she told me never to talk to strangers. Stay out of my way, or I'll make sure you never get in it again. Ooh, scary. Off with their heads, eh? She shot through the car. Damn it. They must have heard me. Oh, but now you have to deal with them. Why are you acting like he's new? Accolade, acceptance and accolade. Shit. But you were coming at me for a hot second. What got you? Fuck you. Whoop shit! I think it has a more complimentary. Is this what the same thing? Yeah, it does. Oh, fuck. You are an issue. Hold on a sec. I'm keeping on coming on, kids. That's all I want to go to fast. 
If you're looking for the kid, he went that way. I literally just gave you directions. Why are you why are you bother me? Why am I your why? Why? Why am I your prerogative at this point? What are you? I don't have time to dance too long. A friend is waiting for me. Shit! Oh, no. Go for you. Is that all you've got? Break it, break it. Whoop! After you too, then. Have you been naughty? Keeping secrets from mummy? Nope. Nothing comes to mind, love. Sorry. But since this is your bloody mess, do you mind hurrying the fuck up and getting rid of this thing? No. Now, that's no way to talk to a lady. No wonder your guardian angels are trying to give you a good spanking. Whatever, love. You've already been following me, so let's make a deal. You save me, I'll show you around this joint. Heading to Fimbleventer, aren't we? That makes two of us. And it'll take two of us, won't it, love? You seem to have skipped school the day they taught basic negotiation skills. You're supposed to negotiate from a position of strength, little one. Not just be a one-trick pony. Ugh. Uh, was something supposed to happen? Um, about that trick. See? You need my power too. <laughs> yeah, shut the fuck up with that one! Ooh. That works too, I suppose. I don't have time to give a shit about who you are or why you're going to the mountain. Take me there and make it quick. You stay with me, and I promise you'll end up in one piece. Got it? Wait, stop. Before I show you the way, love, you gotta agree to a little condition. <sighs> Do we need to go over my lesson again? First, learn to talk to a lady. 
We don't react very well to being insulted, little one. <laughs> well then, I don't react to being called little one. The name's Loki. Loki. And what should I call you, La? I mean, man. Do I look like a man to you? <laughs> Do I look like a man? Bayonetta or Ceresa? Take your pick. <laughs> Ceresa? You don't look like a Ceresa to me. Well then, Bayonetta it is. Let's move, little one. <laughs> hey! I just told you my name is... You'll earn your name when you become a man. Try to keep up. Hi. Oh, what the fuck are you? Instead of fireballs like the last game. Oh, 
it. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Business about. Not a clue, love. Oi! <laughs> <laughs> well, whatever. If your sovereignness is going to get in my way, our deal is over. And if we're going to have to meet any more of your friends, you'd better learn to take care of yourself. I'm quite all right on my own. Got it? Your tricks aren't going to work forever, little one. little magician. Maybe you've got more to offer than I expected. For the time being though, stay here and don't get frisky. Oh no, she, she stuffed him between the boob. That is the one, is it not? Yes. I will never forget that face. Somehow I got a silver. Um, I'm going to guess it, it only is like this because of the combos of time. 